back to Oreo Speedwagon. If you don't know me, my name's Tommy. Wife Rachel is down in the van. She's actually chilly today, so she's hiding out in the back under the down comforter. Badger's back there with her. I just want to take a walk down this little road and let y'all see how rugged and beautiful it is here. I know a lot of people think New Mexico is all desert and it has its fair share, obviously, but also has some rugged mountains in it. I think this is Dalton Creek. It's a tributary of the Pecos River. Pecos River is back down there by where we're camped. Late enough in the year, it's not running. I've actually never seen a creek up here not be running. Maybe they didn't have a big snow pack up in this canyon. You know, I'm not gonna sugarcoat right now. I'm having a very down day. I'm not gonna tell you why. It's nothing about Rachel. It's just, and it's really nothing with me. Like I'm not one of those people that's up, 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 and then down. It's just circumstances. Mainly people, mainly other people, people that say they're friends, people that reach out and want to do things for you didn't ask him to do anything i'm the kind of person if i tell you i'm going to do something i'll do it or i'll kill myself or i'll stay in touch if, if i can't do it i'll be like i can't do it right now for this reason but i'm going to get it done or whatever you know it's communication is key i'm not going to tell you what's going on but it's kind of put us in a it's kind of put us in a not great situation up here you know however though if i'm going to be in a not great situation I mean, this is the place to do it, right? So gorgeous here, and I wish you could smell it. It's it just smells fresh and naturey. I actually plan on heading back to our home area when we can, if that makes sense. Probably. Well, I'll, I'll put it. I'll say it to you this way: If we could do it right now, we would be going back right now because it's in the 70s. You know, and that's the whole point of coming up here is get, getting out of the horrific heat of our home area. Southern Oklahoma, north central Texas, where the kids are and our parents and stuff. You know, again, as much as we love it here, we're ready to see family. We're ready to be around people that we know love us. It's just magnificent here. It's chilly, obviously. I'm wearing a jacket. I'm wearing shorts, but I'm probably going to put pants on when we get back. Or when I get back to the van. I don't know if you can see the clouds up there on the mountain. Some of the drone footage at the start of this video is kind of my clouds on the mountain, fog on the mountain is just a one of those things that for Tommy is soothing. And I needed it today. I needed soothing today. You know, but like I said a while ago, like I said back there. Man, if I'm gonna be down anywhere or have issues or circumstances that are affecting us, this is the place I wanna be. The campsite we're in is not really a place we wanna be, but it works. Um, we've been all over up in here. This is north of Pecos, New Mexico, up in the Santa Fe National Forest, Pecos Wilderness, you know, whatever you wanna call it. You know, we're getting ready to head back when we can. You know, the vast majority of days of the last month, we've been without internet, been without cell service. And we love it. We love being without cell service. But there are times, especially when you do what we do, that it's necessary. So we're kind of ready to get back to where we can be normal, if that makes sense. And there's Badger just staring at me. Let's see what he's doing. What's that little badger man doing? What's that little badger man doing, huh? What's your little fella doing? What are you doing, baby? 